Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name is Jason Newland. This is relaxation hypnosis for stress, anxiety and panic attacks. Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes. Now, this is going to be another fairly short recording and it's going to be an exercise to reduce stress or anxiety. Basically, it's a technique to change the way you feel quite quickly. So what I'm going to ask you to do is to sit down with both of your feet on the ground and, you know, ideally in a comfortable chair. If your chair is not comfortable, then you need to get yourself to a comfortable chair. Chairs, chairs should be comfortable. I'll ask you to put both your hands on your knees, but hands up, so the palms facing up, and just resting. You don't have to like stretch out your palms or, you know, there's no uncomfortableness involved. Just, I mean, your palms don't have to be flat, that's what I mean. What I'm going to ask you to do now is notice the feeling of tension, stress, anxiety, whatever, whatever it is. Notice where it is in your body. So maybe you feel it in the back of your neck your chest, your stomach, your forehead, your eyes, your jaw, your lower back. It could be any anywhere, wherever it is within your body. What I'm going to ask you to do is to move that feeling from where it is now. And just move it through your body. into your hand and have that feeling of tension in let's say your left hand just for the sake of argument of course you can do the other hand if you want but for the sake of this exercise as I do it, it might make it easier but you know you can choose I'm going to move the tension into my left hand. So I'm moving it from, yeah, it's moving down from my left shoulder into my left hand. It doesn't have to physically move through your body, but the energy moves from where it was to where it is now in your hand. And just notice a heaviness there and there's, there's a an uncomfortableness as you focus on that hand focusing on that feeling And just be aware of it. And you can just allow even more tension from your body to move into that hand. Maybe anything that presents itself in a form of chronic pain, you can allow that to also move to that one hand. As you focus on that hand, 
you know that's where it is and you can feel it. You can feel the pressure in their hand. And what I'm going to do now, while that tension and stress, anxiety is in that hand, you can leave it there for now. It can, you know, just be there doing its thing. But it doesn't have to move anywhere else. It's getting all the attention it wants from you. So you can just leave that there for a few moments. As you now go into your mind and you focus on a nice thought. A sense of love that you have maybe for someone close to you. It can just be a lightness, a kindness, a uh, compassion, whatever that feeling is. I want you to move that into the other hand. And as you move that feeling into the other hand, notice how the other hand feels quite nice. It's light, soft and gentle. The other hand's heavy, but the hand with the love, the gentleness, kindness, gratitude, it's almost fluffy like a cloud. The other one's hard like a rock, a smelly, damp rock. And you can feel the difference. There's a real difference. I can feel that the the hand, the original hand with all the tension and stress and anxiety in, it's pushing right against my knee. It's very uncomfortable. Yet my other hand, it's not literally floating, but it feels like it could just float away. Feels so light and gentle. And on the count to three, when I get to three, I want you just to push your hands together. One, two, three. And just hold them and rub them together gently. And just keep them together and notice what happens. So that feeling as you focus on both of your hands at the same time. Keeping them pressed, but gently. And if holding them up and pressing them together, if that's a bit too much physically, you can just stretch your legs out and allow them just to be on your lap, or maybe even turn your hands, so as long as the palms are touching, and you can gently and softly stroke each palm with the fingers of the other hand. That's right. Notice how gentle and soft it feels and pleasurable to gently stroke the palms of your hands with the fingertips of your other hand, taking turns. As you gently rub your hands together and 
rub the backs of your hands with the palms of the other hand. Then you can take your left hand, move it up to the elbow of your right arm and just brush down with your hand all the way down the arm, over the hand and doing the same with your left hand, touching your arm at the elbow of your left arm and just gently stroking down. And then just lastly, rubbing your hands a little bit as if you would if you'd just been making a sand castle or something. Just getting those few little grains of sand out of your hands. And then relax your hands and your arms. And notice how much more relaxed you feel. Now. That's the end of this recording. Remember to be kind to yourself because you deserve to be happy. Lots of love. Bye.